creation of the center itself was a, a real beacon for UBC in showing how it would support the progress in education, research, scholarship for Indigenous peoples. There have been many moments of joy at the Center for Excellence in Indigenous Health, whether it's new programs that we've been able to offer, uh, new curriculum that we've been able to create. When we hire new faculty, new staff, new students to join the Center, and we see them blossom. The students we meet are really uh, the leaders of tomorrow, and you can't help but be proud uh, to be part of that. The catalyst for our involvement in Indigenous health was actually a lecture that we attended by Murray Sinclair, who was the chair of the Truth and Reconciliation at the time. And it started a journey of discovery about the history and uh, discrimination against Indigenous peoples in uh, Canada and especially in uh, healthcare. Being half Indigenous and half European ancestry, um, I felt like there wasn't a place exactly where I belonged. When I started working with the Centre, I really strengthened that connection with my Indigenous culture and I felt like I finally had a community I could be a part of. I remember I called my mom as soon as we had our first training session and I said, oh my gosh, I've figured it out. This is exactly what I want to do. It's that light bulb moment. And I just felt so passionate finally about a topic. When I was first introduced to the Indigenous Public Health Program, it came at a time in my life where I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do, but I knew I needed to create change. And I've always, like, since I was a little kid, wanted to create change for Indigenous people. Because growing up on a reserve, I saw the inequalities that occurred daily around me. Um, I'm the first one in my family to be a graduate student, so it's really exciting. And just my connection to the Indigenous community here at UBC and my network within Indigenous Health has grown exponentially through all the opportunities I've had at the Centre. I believe that with donor support, we open up the field to allow Indigenous populations who financially couldn't attend these types of programs to be able to create change where it's needed. We're very proud of our involvement um, in Indigenous health. It has been and I think continues to be uh, an excellent initiative and we'd love uh, for you to join us in supporting uh, this great initiative with a gift. I was so grateful that we had the opportunity, we had the wherewithal to contribute to their future. They're going to be leaders in their community. I wish I had a trillion dollars. <laughs> it was so heartwarming. So far, every program we've developed, every course we've created, every opportunity that we've offered has had incredible impact personally, in communities, and at the university at large. I can't wait to see where the future of the Center for Excellence in Indigenous Health is. I know that it's gonna be exciting.